what's going on g family and as you can see we are back with another one for tonight i hope y'all boy are having a great time whenever y'all are watching this whether it's morning noon or night and listen man y'all have been going absolutely stupid for the tom mcdonald and eminem so i feel like i should I, I don't want to use the word exploit it, but I just want to take advantage, but then I don't want to overdo it. I don't know what I should do because I do. Someone asked if I want to go down the Tom rabbit hole and I said yes. Well, I didn't re I didn't respond, but this is my response. I said I'm saying yes. So this is like I do want to go down the rabbit hole. Y'all told me to make a playlist. I made a playlist. Listen, I will put out these videos, but I just don't know how often. And that's why a lot of videos I go without posting because I don't want to flood y'all with like the same artists over and over again because I don't want to milk it dry. You feel me? Like I still want to have variety with the channel. You feel me? I'm trying to catch out. I'm trying to cast out a big net and I'm willing to explore with music like certain songs I might not do like heavy metal. And then there was this one kid suggesting suggesting this one song that's like just totally for kids and listen I, I i i appreciate the love and support by you subscribing and you watching the videos and you commenting but listen most of us are adults here i can't be doing that kitty i'm not trying to attract no kids you feel what i'm saying i am not diddy you feel me you're not gonna catch me with justin beaver you feel me i'm just saying i'm just saying and if you're too young to understand, then you wasn't meant to understand. I'm just saying. But um, man, that's not the point. The point is, man, I'm just trying to, I'm trying to do what works for y'all, and I'm trying to do what works for me. I'm trying to balance it out as best I can. I'm not complaining. I'm just saying that I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm just confused. I'm lost and confused, trying to figure it out as I go. But let's go ahead and get into this, man. I'm going to react to Tom McDonald. I don't care. This was a request. People saying I should check out these different songs if I don't want to hear like too much of the controversial. And I like his controversial stuff because he's bringing, bringing attention to topics that need to be addressed. But it's like, I don't want to hear it all the time. And this is giving me a chance to really explore his other types of music. So I'm more than willing to react to it. Leave more in the comments if y'all feel like I should react to something else. Even if it's controversial to some degree, I'm not saying it doesn't have to be. Listen, send whatever you want to send. I'll, I'll react to it. I'll react to it. I'll go down this rabbit hole. I'll see what it's about. I'm still trying to learn about Eminem too. I'm going to have some more videos coming out with him. But let's go ahead, man. I'm talking too much. <laughs> All right, I had to start it over because of advertisement. So we're going to try this one more time. I, I, I just keep delaying everything for y'all. <laughs> Honestly, I'm sick to death of hearing the complaints. Everybody wants to tell me how I've changed. I think somehow I'm responsible for bodies filling graves. If I made the songs they wanted, were they fans I could have saved? Man, that's a lot of weight. Wait, I thought it would be great to entertain. And now I understand why mumble rappers say the things they say. They don't want any obligation to the fan base they create. I guess my morals won't allow me to be famous if it's fake. I barely made it. I was living in the ghetto. Always praying my potential wouldn't go to waste before I could escape it. I just had a mental breakdown. Rent was due. I couldn't pay it. Killing roaches. Just scraping guts off all the plates and being patient Ay. Living in the hood, could've got me killed Kitchen full of rats, stomach never filled They cut off the lights, could've paid the bills I was always sick, could've buy the pills Girlfriend almost left me, we were broken We were desperate, right before it got too heavy I went viral off a record, Ay. Never signed a deal, I did it on my own I made all the beats, I write every song They did not believe I knew it all along Told me I was weak, I showed them I was strong Never should've bet against me Thought my anxiety was gonna wreck me Thought my depression would get in my head for a second and leave But it never left me Everybody says I changed up, changed up Cause I had nothing then I came up, came up Now I'm someone that I'm afraid of, afraid of So say some, say some, oh, oh, oh Hey yo, everything you say bro I don't care, no, I don't care, bro Fame won't ever make me change, so I don't care, no, I don't care, no Honestly, 
it's bothered me since I've become this famous People comment like I don't see what they're saying I get death threats every day and saw my family Call me garbage, call me racist Try to tell my therapist that I'm afraid I can't explain it uh, Back up, don't touch me, I'm anxious All of this money I'm banking Don't make me happy, I can't win Don't get it wrong, no, I'm thankful Wanted attention, it happened Pressure from standards established Amplify anger and sadness Can't deny that it did damage Hey, take the bucks I made Take off all the chains Take the braids out of my hair Laser the tattoos off my face Stop comparing me to Hobson Token and FNM I think they're great, but so am I And I don't wanna be them And I never change, but I'm not the same I'm not the person that I was once Alcoholic always calling mama Always trying to borrow 50 bucks Uh, hey, I put my parents in debt I have embarrassed my friends I didn't care if I died I was honestly hopeful that I wouldn't wake up again But I'm back now Knock me down to that man But now I stand proud Last round Believe me, I'm ready to scrap until they back down Doctor gave me pills, told me I was sad Never took them though, threw them in the trash Made a couple mil, money doesn't last Trying to smile a bit, living in the past Everybody says I changed up, changed up Cause I had nothing and I came up I bought it, I'm no sellout, homie, stop it This is a symbol of the work I did that's finally acknowledged This is robbed at corner stores while getting soda and some chocolate This is bullied all my life by kids at school, I ain't forgot it This is profit that I got from sacrificing food and water This is dollars I had after finally paying back my father This is failing grades and skipping class and dropping out of college You can't stop me, that's your problem, I will get it if I want it Stop telling me that I switched sides, my life changed, I'm a different guy My mama proud, my girl stoked, my sister happy I didn't die They're mad instead Instead of saying, Tom, I wish you the best Of course I changed, I had to go and buy a bulletproof vest Cause I've been stressed, yeah, I'm a mess, yeah I need rest, yeah Wasting energy on enemies I never met, yeah I need meds, yeah, I need bed, yeah What the heck, I should send a text to see if I still have some friends, yeah Now that I'm healthy and nobody helped me I wanna get every penny independent I'm a menace, I'm a wreck it All my records got a message, I'ma spread it And I'm still the person my mama nurtured to become this version So shout out mom, I don't ever sleep Every night is long, everything is on me, Tom Everybody says I changed up, changed up Cause I had nothing and I came up, came up Now I'm someone that afraid of, afraid of So say some, say some God damn, this man, hey man, hey man, you see that, I'm gonna leave the, the hold on, before I maximize this video so y'all can see my face, y'all see this white boy, that, oh my god, <laughs> bro is so white, bro, and I mean that with all love, bro, like, that, that dude is so white, bro, like, I just can't with this guy, alright, I can maximize the screen, I, I just can't, I can't, bro. But um, this was an older song, and um, it did have like that. I don't, I don't know, like that. Uh, yeah, like that. They just that older vibe to it. But um, lyrics wise, we gonna go ahead and get into the lyrics. I felt like you know he's always speaking something. You know, I've learned the different genre of rap where they actually talking about something. He talking about, you know, the stresses of uh being, you know, famous and things of that nature. I don't even know what to say, man. Like I, I'm I'm trying to I, I wouldn't say I'm trying to just be famous, but I'm I'm trying to build an audience and I I I, I don't know what to tell you, Bubba, like I haven't experienced that stuff, and I know that there's a lot that comes with it that I probably can't even dream of imagining, you feel me? And the way I feel about it, bro, like, just, I never had a bad life. Like, as a kid, bro, mama had me straight. Like, we weren't rich, but, like, nigga, you know, didn't have to wear hand-me-downs, Nigga didn't have to, you know, experience the light being cut off, you know, like no food in the house and stuff like that. Like, 
nigga ain't been down bad, down bad, living in the trenches, you, you know what I mean? Like, my mama made the best out of the situation we was in. But we wasn't rich by no means. I mean, Christmas did look good, you know. That's because daddy been chipping in, you feel me? What? I know my dad? You shut your mouth. Yes, I do. <laughs> nah, I'm just joking. But, um, yeah, um, yeah, dad chipped in, so, you know, childhood wasn't bad you know at all but after childhood becoming an adult and getting like slapped in the face and being shown like bro you know life ain't sweet unless you you know set yourself up to some degree you feel me no rhyme intended but i'm i'm serious like if you don't do something to set yourself up to some degree bro you're not gonna have nothing and i was realizing that very quickly because I, I, I don't like the work. I, I'm not going to say I didn't because I still don't like doing it. But you got to do what you got to do. And back then, I it was hard for me to maintain a job because of that. I couldn't just stay down and, you know, do the work. I always had a reason for why I shouldn't have been there. And, you know, now that I got the job I got now, and I'm more, like, proud of it, I guess. It's more more of a meaningful job, like, I don't want to tell no nigga I work at McDonald's. Like I, I know I'm just 24 years old. I'm still like, I'm coming out of that college age. I'm slowly getting older, which is crazy. But um, then going so it's like, I, it's not. It wouldn't be as bad to say like, yo, I work at McDonald's. But at the same time, it's like, nigga, no, that's embarrassing. I, even younger than that, I felt like that's embarrassing. I don't want to tell nobody I work at Sonics. I don't want people to see my greased out shirt outside of work. At work, you can't help it. They're going to see you. But when I'm outside of work, hell no, nah, I don't want people to know I'm flipping burgers and stuff like that, bro. I wanted to do something better than that. So now that I got a job that I'm actually, you know, proud to tell people about, I guess, you know, it made going to work easier. But, um... I'd rather, I'd rather just, I'd rather, I'd rather be famous, bro. Well, maybe not famous, but I'd rather chase something that I feel like is plausible for me to chase to make money. Like, you could do anything to make money. If you, like, you could do anything to be good at it. Like, you just have to put the repetition in, you know, it's consistency and you know, constantly trying to improve and stuff like that and being determined to, to not give up and not let other people's success or failures discourage you from chasing your thing. And it's just like, it's just like, yeah, damn, I, I, I feel like this YouTube thing, you know, this YouTube thing is me. Like, I know that I'm not perfect right now. I know that I could be doing way more than what I am doing. But I'm doing my best for right now. And and it's working to some degree. Like, yeah, it's working. It's doing its thing. But, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I can't complain. Like, the channel is moving. Like, I, I was looking at the thing. At my statistics, my analytics, and um, and it was saying it was telling me that from September to now, September of September twentieth, twenty twenty four, to October twenty sixth, twenty twenty four, it was telling me that um, that um, I've we've gained like forty three subscribers. And that's just over a month. That's literally a couple of days over a month. And that's crazy, bro. Like the channel, the channel's actually doing stuff. So I can't say that it's not, but I guess I'm just trying to, you know, rush things too fast and I'm not being patient, you know. But I'm, I'm talking about my damn self. All I'm trying to say is that, like, I get what he's saying about the stresses, but my my reaction to that, my review to that is I'd rather deal with that than be poor. 
You feel me? That's basically what I'm trying to say. Like, I'd rather just deal with the stresses that come with being famous than being poor. Bro, I'll just take take my money and go to a different country if need be. I'll just come back to America so damn much you think I live in America, nigga. <laughs> like, I be here so damn much you think I live here. But nah, my, me and my family chilling in some random country where people don't know about us that much. You feel me? And it's just like... And, and 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 then that brings up the importance of having investments. Like if you put your money into other things so your money can grow other places, you don't have to do rap forever. He could, you know, eventually I know y'all fans don't want to hear that, but I'm just saying that hey, I'm just saying for him. For him. He could leave the rap scene or just leave the, the whole social thing. Maybe he could still post music, but stop being so social about it. Stop promoting it. Just on the low end, just posting the music. You feel me? And then just yeah, go ghost. Nobody know where he's at. And he can live his life. Still put out music. Have his protection. Keep, you know. I heard he just got married. Congratulations. I know he's not going to see this, but congratulations. But, um, yeah, so it's just like you got to protect your family, man. So I get what you, you know, I get what you're going through to some degree. I I empathize with you, but um, yeah, man. But let, let me go ahead and get to the reaction. I think it was a good song. I think it was a good song. If I had to rate it though, I'd probably give that thing about a seven. A seven. It wouldn't like it. It, it was. It wasn't a bad song. I just don't think it was really my type of song. But I mean, the message of it was good. It's just the way he performed it. That's the only thing. That's the only thing that got me. I think he could have made it a little bit more catchier. But, hey, I'm not knocking it. I give it a 7. I give it a 7. Playability-wise, play I'd have to give that thing about a 2. A 2. I might listen to it again and see how I feel about it. I don't know, man. I be saying some harsh stuff when I listen to the stuff the first time. But y'all got to understand, it's a first-time reaction. A lot of these videos... A lot of these songs, unless I tell you I've heard it before, it's it's first time. So it's just like sometimes I give a reaction that I might turn around and be like, you know what? I shouldn't have said that. Sometimes I do that. Sometimes I'm not perfect. I'm giving you my first time genuine reaction. Would I say that's not a legit reaction? Would you consider that not a legit reaction? Well, first of all, go fuck yourself if you think that. But, um. I wouldn't say it's not legit. I'm just telling you how I feel right then and there. You feel me? I'm giving you, like, if you came up to me and this was your song and you played it to me and I listened to it, th th that would be my initial reaction. Now, if I change my mind, if I could reach back out to you, I'll definitely reach back out and be like, hey, listen, I've been listening to it for a little bit. And you know what? It's not that bad, bro. I'm rocking with it. I'm rocking. But I'm not about to sit there and... And say, yeah, I'm rocking with every song up front. And I'm really not rocking with it, you know. So I'm going to tell you how I feel right then and there. And if I change my mind, I'll speak on it later. But, um, yeah, man, it was it was decent song. So the playability, too. The overall song, a 7. The message was I, the message was 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Talking about real, like, real deal stuff. And, you know, I had to give a reaction, give a review to that you know i had to talk about that because i felt like you know it's it's kind of funny for me to hear him like complain about these things and then i'm low-key chasing these things you see what i'm saying so i just had to speak on that but yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this man i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up hit that like button write something down in the comment section man and last but not least before you head out my brothers and sisters don't forget don't forget don't forget Hit that subscribe button, big dog. Make sure you tune in, man. Got more videos coming, more videos on the way. It's 1 o'clock in the morning. I need to be asleep, but my ass had got drunk, and I ended up going to sleep uh, like at 5 o'clock, bro. Got drunk and fell asleep at 5. I'm no good. I'm no good. Yeah, but I fell asleep, so I'm up. I'm probably going to go to sleep after recording, but I needed to get some videos out for when I go to work and I got one for, I have one for the night and then I think I got one for tomorrow. So yeah, I just need some for when I go to work.
and then I have some left over, hopefully, for the future, so I don't have to, you know, always record, you yeah, feel me, no, 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 I need to keep recording, keep recording, maybe a video a day, like, get a couple videos ahead, like, three, four videos days ahead, and then have, like, just record one video a day to keep it piling, keep it piling, keep it piling, keep it piling, I don't know, I'll figure out a routine to put out videos more so I don't have these videos disappearing on you guys, I, I want to try to, you know, wrinkle out all the hiccups I can, as best as I can, I'm working on it, I'm working on it, god damn it, subscribe to the channel to see if I fix my problems, god damn it, <laughs> but I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one, peace.